Resonance area connection established. Link strength is fluctuating, but within parameters. All right, good luck in there. This is the first time we've met in person, isn't it? Costa Heidenstam, Head of Transmission Engineering Research. We're developing transmission technology using bias fields. I'm Josiah Kwan, a specialist in nanomachines. I owe much to your father, and I'm very glad to meet you. I've heard a lot about both of you from the director of the Far East Branch. Oh, well, that's an honor. That's when Soma met them. I've seen your theory on generating auto-regressive networks using retro-oracle cells. An old man like me would never have conceived of it. Your insight is marvelous. So what did you want? The proposed Ragnarok project. We'd like you to help realize it. controlled network of God Ark nanomachines operated through a bias field. Aragami touching it would be devoured by the altering of the nanomachine's bias tendency. That's the basic idea of the Ragnarok project, right? The project needs an AI, a central core, to operate the nanomachines. We can't create it without your brilliant mind, Dr. Schicksel. You think too highly of me. Dr. Shiksol, can you say humanity is truly living right now? We've been fodder for Aragami for 30 years. I want to put an end to that. I want to lead humanity to a new life. <laughs> so I joined the project. CI ratio is too low. We absolutely must have higher oscillations. We'll place autonomous amplifiers at each relay station. I'll create a model. I'd heard the rumors, but this far exceeds what I imagined. What do you mean? <laughs> Bringing you aboard was the right choice. Right, Dr. Heidenstam? Someone really seemed happy for once. Dr. Heidenstein, Dr. Schicksal, we finally reached this stage. If the next simulation goes well, we can finally proceed to testing. Yeah, but the conditions need to be just right. 
We need time to evaluate the results. <laughs> you're brilliant, Dr. Schicksel, but you're also very cautious. <laughs> it's what he does best. Go ahead. Investigate until you're satisfied. They were only a step away. Find all the specifics in the written report. But to summarize the situation, the analysis of the simulation confirms a major vulnerability in the system. If it were to get out of control during a test run, it could cause a global catastrophe with devastating consequences. We need to postpone the testing. Hmm. How long do you estimate the delay would be? Well, we're closely examining everything right now. It's already clear that core components will need to be redesigned and installed, though. All in all, we're looking at a delay of at least 24 months, including verification, and maybe up to four years. Dr. Schicksel, objectively speaking, I can see no clear flaw in the logic of your Report. However, the problem you're describing here would only occur if the central core had human-level intelligence. Are you saying that the core you led the development for is capable of such a fantastic thing? It's not conclusive. I'm only saying it's a possibility. <laughs> so you're suggesting we delay the project for an unknown possibility? That's ridiculous. Dr. Kwan, we should perform the test as scheduled. That's... that's crazy. You're willing to ignore the danger and still go ahead with the test? <laughs> yes, yes. You've always seemed terribly afraid it would fail, Dr. Schicksel. Dr. Heidenstam, that's going too far. I, for one, understand Dr. Schicksel's concerns all too well. Yet, here we are. We are not in a position to control every little pebble we find on the side of the road. We simply have to keep forging ahead. You, of all people, are well aware of how much funding has gone into this project. And think of all the people working tirelessly in R&D. We can't let them down. We're, in essence, responsible for their lives. Don't you understand? Their lives would be under more immediate threat if the test failed. All right. All right, Dr. Schicksal. I can see you simply want to postpone the test no matter what. With that in mind, all further discussion will take place between myself and Dr. Heidenstab. Dr. Kwan! Look, if we can deal with the issues, then you'll have no objections. Isn't that right, Dr. Schicksal? Yes. Then we'll work together to prepare a proposal. And soon. Please just wait for us to get in touch with you. you before. There's something very important I have to do quickly. I will eat Soma to save him.
Vital signs are normal. Resonance area connection established. The area is heavily warped, so please use all due caution. All right, please begin. memories of that day. Why? Dr. Kwan and Dr. Heidenstam haven't contacted me in a week now. What could be going on? something that's good about him. Someone! Answer me! Now! Come on. I'll play with you some more.
It was always like that. I was with Soma, but I could never do anything. That time was the same. But now, for a little while, if I'm quick, I can eat Soma to save him. <laughs> 